بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹوڈے وی آر گوئنگ ٹو سالو پریکٹس ناؤ ایٹ پیج نمبر تھری تھرٹی ون کوشچن از دا فگر شوز اے ٹریپیزیم پی کیو آر ایس اف یو لک ایٹ دا فگر سو دس فگر از اے ٹریپیزیم دا نیم آف دس ٹریپیزیم از پی کیو آر ایس ویئر پی کیو از ایکول ٹو فورٹین میٹر اینڈ آر ایس از ایکول ٹو ٹین میٹر اف دا ایریا اینڈ دا پیری میٹر آف دا ٹریپیزیم آر سیونٹی ٹو میٹر اسکوئر اینڈ تھرٹی سیون پوائنٹ ٹو میٹر رسپیکٹولی فائنڈ دا لینتھ آف نمبر ون پی ایس اینڈ نمبر ٹو دا لینتھ آف کیو آر so students in this question the area of this trapezium pqrs is given that is 72 square meter and the perimeter is also given that is 37.2 meter so first of all we will find the length that is ps and it is also uh, perpendicular so by using the formula The formula is area of trapezium is equal to half multiplied by sum of length of parallel sides multiplied by height. Formula is area of trapezium is equal to half multiplied by sum of lengths of parallel sides multiplied by height. H means height. So dear students, uh, we are going to write down the values. So area is given, area of trapezium is 72 meter square. So we write here 72 meter square is equal to, this is half 1 by 2 multiply by sum of length of parallel sides. One side is PQ that is of length 14 meter and the second side is, other side is RS that is 10 meter. So we write here in the form of sum. So first of all, write here P14 meter plus 10 meter. Multiply by height. So height actually, this is the height. PS side is the height. So height is not given. We have to find it. So we write here height. Height for PS. Now dear students, add these two values and multiply 2 by 72. So some we write here 72 multiplied by 2 meter square is equal to 1 into, four, uh, one into uh, 14 meter plus 10 meter is the same 14 meter plus 10 meter is what? 24 meter multiply by PS if we add 14 meter plus 10 meter so we get 424 meter now students divide by 24 on both sides so here we have 2 into 2 is 4 2, 2 into 7 is 14 here we have 144 meter square and now also dividing by both sides by 24 meter so here we write 24 meter that is equal to ps here is ps so now students divide meters cancel by one meter so meter is left now if you multiply 24 with 6 so answer is 144 so 24 ones are 24 and 24 six are 144 it means that this implies that we have find out the value that is the length PS is equal to 6 meter. So this is the answer of PS. Now dear students, we will find the length of QR. So that is the second part. This is the first part. So right here, right here first part. 
now second part is here we will find the length of qr now students perimeter of this trapezium is also given that is 37.2 meter so we know the formula the perimeter actually is the total length of outer boundary so this is trapezium it has four sides pq qr rs or n also ps so we add we write here p is equal to perimeter is equal to pq plus qr plus rs rs plus ps actually students we we are going to find out the length that is qr so we have we know the lengths of perimeter pq rs and ps we have find out in the part one now by putting the values perimeter is given that is 37.2 meter equal to what is the length of pq pq is given that is 14 meter plus qr qr is we have to find out so write as it is qr plus rs what is the value of rs that is 10 meter plus ps what is the length of ps that is 6 meter now dear students add 14 meter 10 meter and 6 meter so we if we add 14 plus 10 24 24 plus 6 30 we got 30 meter plus qr here we have 37.2 meter now dear students if we subtract 30 from 37.2 meter so first of all right here 37.2 meter minus 30 meter is equal to qr and we have the answer 7.2 meter is equal to qr so this implies that the length of qr is equal to what 7.2 meter so this is the answer of part 2 and this is the answer of part 1 in part 1 dear students we have to find out the length ps so this is the way we have find it by using the formula area of trapezium is equal to half into sum of the length of parallel sides multiplied by height so we by putting the values and by calculating we have find out the height that is actually ps is the height height is 6 meter, six meter. and in the second part we have to find out the length qr and by using the formula of perimeter perimeter is also given that is 37.2 meter and it is actually the length of all the sides of the given figure so p is equal to by writing p is equal to pq plus qr plus rs plus ps by putting the values except qr because it, it we have to find it and we have 37.2 meter equal to 14 meter plus qr plus 10 meter plus 6 here we add by adding we get 30 meter and by subtracting 37.2 meter minus 30 meter we get 7.2 meter and the length of qr equal to 7.2 meter students i hope that you have easily understood uh, the question practice now 8 uh, that is given on page 331 if you are new to this channel please subscribe and also share it take care allah Hafiz.